A Karabakh war veteran, disabled of the second group, Amiro, received an unjustified nut of the requirement to leave the house in which he was born and grew up at 24 Fizuli Street on November 22 last year. On December 22, the whole family was just thrown into the street. After my family was taken to police station 21 of the Nazimi district, my home was destroyed and all the property was looted. Emerald said at a press conference at the Institute for Reporters Freedom and Safety today. According to Emirov and other speakers, the city officials began demolishing housing in the streets Shamsi Bedal Bailey, Mirzaga Aliyev and Dilara Aliyeva. The demolition area is expanding, although the government previously claimed that the demolition would only regard the houses in Fizuli Street. Residents of this area believe that under the guise of constructing the Winter Boulevard, the historical center of the city is captured by the officials. The department head at the State Property Camp Yusuf Gambarov and the head of the Secretariat of the City Hall of Baku, Zilfalis, offered the residents compensation in the amount of 1,500 Azure Manas per 1 square meters or an apartment. So, if the squaring is small and not tantamount to an apartment in a new building, then people are given the money. If the effective area is 70 square meters, the people are offered an apartment of 105 square meters in a new building outside the center. The apartments are built by joint stock company Azinko belonging to the leadership of the state property company. Recall that last year a similar drama has been happening in Fizuli Street where thousands of families were evicted in the same way. Their numerous protests and lawsuits against the executives were not satisfied.